And what's up? Welcome to part two of Eurocracy. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video where the show and shine is, the drag circuit, um, the Mustangs, the Ferraris, the Lamborghinis, and everything. Um, I use a lot of different apps to like do my editing and stuff. So I always, it takes me days to edit my videos because I edit my video on every single videoing app that I have to see like what options do I have for music backgrounds, um, slow motions, time lapse there's so many and motions as well there's so many apps out there that i i don't even know about um it's really really crazy um so i hope you guys enjoy part one so get ready for part two let's go all right so let me give you guys a bit of a a bit of a you know a view of what's to come now security are here uh they're making sure everyone for media if you want to be on the track or the burnout pits, you gotta have a media bracelet, which I got, so it's all good. Also, you guys can see the crowd, right? I was inside there last year, so again, whoever I whoever I was talking to on Messenger Eurocracy, huge thanks, huge huge thanks, and I promise you, I'll get you guys good footage this time, not like last year.
No, that's how it's done.
bungee over here, apparently. So we got a Subi. It looks like he's gonna swing it or something. Normally they all-wheel drive, but he probably converted to rear wheel. Well, that's one clean Subaru. What did you do, buddy? A Jay Z and a Subi. I'm not gonna lie, that's the first time I've seen one. Wow, that's a lot of money, too, though. Softing into that, that's a lot of money. That's a clean Subaru. Like, Rally Blue is one of my favorite ones. But hey, my Subaru is still good, okay? Opa, come on now. Got a whole crowd, boys. So far, the, the burnout show has been crazy. Um, you got JCs, you got Subarus, you got 240s, and then you got this guy. Bro! 
This looks really promising.
Blown gasket, buddy. Yes. So it's not a gasket, the guy blew his motor. So rest in peace. But he put on one hell of a smoke show. Definitely.
just like that, we are back from part two. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I had. I had an amazing time, a huge experience. Again, huge thanks to Eurocracy for giving me a media pass. Um, I know it's not that easy getting one from them because you have to. They say you have to have a large viewings or large followings and stuff like that. But you know, for small YouTube guys like me, it's not that easy because the reason I don't get much views and on all that subscribers because basically my youth, my upload schedule is all over the place. I'm always working constantly. I'm missing up all the car meets, the car shows, and all that. And it's a pain in the ass to do work and vlog at the same time for car shows, but I'm doing as best I can. Um, I don't know any car meets as for, as for now. I mean, I know my boy Wayne would probably tell me, listen, there's a car meet there, you want to join me? I would probably tell him, yes, let, I'll go. But um, other than that, um, hope you guys enjoyed part two. I honestly, I didn't expect a freaking Subaru like that to be a Jay-Z. I didn't expect that at all. Clearly, that guy has a lot of cash, but um, you guys know Jay-Z's are my dream engines to have. I would love to have a Jay-Z, like it's, but it's way, way out of the question. It's not going to happen. Just in case I didn't show you guys, um, I actually just installed my Capital Tuning uh, banner. Um, kind of a little, kind of a little crooked around. Um, I don't know how I got this crooked, but this one is completely straight. That's actually kind of weird, but... Still got to rest in peace for Paul Walker. You know how it is, boys. Um, the last banner I will have is going to be the Subi Flow banner. Um, I've actually been wanting that, to be honest. Um, I've seen a lot of Subarus have it. Every time I go to Senior Stash or iCar, like 90% of the Subarus actually have it. Um, they basically have it like on their on their windshield. But um, I don't know if I can show you guys. Somewhere around here, there's like a, a mark of how high you could have a sticker or how low you could have a sticker. There's, there's like a law about that apparently. So, I don't know, for like 30, 40 bucks, I wanna get like a 40 inch Subi Flow banner and put it just across my thing and stuff like that. But other than that, I mean, car is looking great, I love it. Got doors, everything's good. Um, we still got some work to do on the car. So, uh, you guys can honestly stay tuned for that. Um, July 10th or 11th, we're hitting Capital Tuning again. Uh, we're going to be doing my brake lines, which are very, very important. And we're going to be doing my Fender, my new one that I have, which is going to go on the left front. Um, and we also have some Subaru wheels. We got to clean them up real nice, wash them, sand them down. Um, we, and we're gonna color them and we're gonna paint them basically. Um, I'm gonna go with gold basic Subaru color and uh, we'll see from there. Still got some body work I gotta f just figure out on how to do. Obviously I didn't do a good job because you just you can't just paint over this. You gotta really like do a bondo kind of thing on this but uh, I saw some videos on how to do it and I'm just gonna go ahead and fucking do it. If I fuck up, I fuck up. I don't care. She needs a bath though guys. She needs a bath, but I haven't washed her in over a month, like for real. Now, this fender here probably gonna have to be repainted. Uh, just basically color match just along the edges around here. Not a big deal. But other than that, she drives well and I love it. So before I leave you guys, I know I'm talking a lot, but I'm just trying to give you guys some updates before I leave you guys. Um, we're going to do, I'm not sure if it's going to be in two separate vlogs or just in one big vlog, but we are going to be um, washing, painting the, the my, my Subaru wheels. We have to wash them, sand them, clean them out before we do paint. We have to prime it too. And another one is I have my black fender. I'm going to sh actually show you guys this. I got this from Kenny Upo. Really cheap actually. A black fender right there. I'll show you guys better. There we go. A little greasy inside, but this one is actually in much, much better condition. So basically all I gotta do is sand it really, really, really good, prime it, and then color match it, and then ba-boom, it's gonna be installed. And that's about, that's about it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed part two. Um, if you guys wanna see anything done to this car randomly, uh, any mods or interior stuff or exterior stuff, let me know. My, my ears are open. Like I said, it's a project car. There's, there's always something a little bit I want to do to the car. And, uh, yep, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys very much for watching. Remember, subscribe to the channel and like the videos. That way it helps me 
to upload more. I know, like I said, I know that my uploads are everywhere. It's a mess, my channel, I know that. It's just my job gets in the way of it. It's hard for me to vlog, but I'm doing my best. Um, we got some, we got some exciting events coming up very soon. I'll see you guys then. Peace.